Hey guys, Paul Counts here. I just want to give you a very quick demo of the landing page monkey software that I've been telling you about for the past few days. Now, I feel very strongly about the software. I actually personally invested in it because it's a phenomenal value, especially for the fact that it's a one-time fee. And also the most important fact for me was I really need to update a lot of my landing pages and squeeze pages. Like here are here's like one of my current squeeze pages, and I really want to make this a lot better. I want to make it more mobile friendly I want to bring it up to 2015 which is what we're coming up to now this page has performed very well I've gotten about 56% opt-in uh, but I know guys that are using software like landing page monkey that are seeing 70% opt-ins or higher not to mention they're actually able to reach people on the mobile devices even better and that's what sets this tool apart that's why I'm so excited about it because you've probably done it yourself. You've probably gotten an email, clicked on it on your mobile device and opted in through your mobile device. And so these pages are going to look great on a computer, on a, you know, on your iPad or a some sort of a tablet PC on the netbook computers and most importantly on the mobile devices like iPhones or the Android devices so it's gonna look good across all platforms that's one key reason you want to invest in this tool and use it the other big reason of course is that you know other similar tools like lead pages for example it's a phenomenal tool but it's gonna cost you a monthly fee so if you go over here to lead pages uh, you're looking at you know an annual monthly fee of forty dollars a month if you choose the annual charge. Otherwise, you're paying sixty-seven dollars a month, um, you know, to keep it, which is about eight hundred and four dollars a year. Um, if you do an annual, you're looking at about four hundred dollars per year. So that's a yearly expense. Whereas Landing Page Monkey is a one-time expense. Now there are you know a few more things you could possibly do with with uh, lead pages, but you know with with Landing Page Monkey here you're going to get access to most everything that you need to do. In fact, I think it's a great tool to have in your arsenal because it's very flexible, gives you more options than actually lead pages, which is very template driven. So if we go here to landing page monkey and we're going to go up here to create a page, and we're going to call this demo for what we're doing here. Uh, box position, this is where the box that's going to show up when people land on your page, there's going to be an opt-in box. And so you want to choose if you want it in the middle, if you want it to the left or to the right. We're going to go with the middle here. And you could choose the background color. And I'll show you uh, kind of an idea here. So, um, you know, this is what the page looks like right now because we have nothing on it. Um, and then this right here, your headline goes here. This is what they're talking about with the box. So just keep that in mind uh, as you design it. So we're just going to go, um, you know, they have a default color here. I actually know for a fact from a lot of testing that color works really well. You could choose your own background image. Uh, now this part of the tool um, is really neat, the background video. And I'll talk about that here in just a moment. Uh, the button background color, we'll go with this bright green, uh, but if you were to click on this, you could actually choose a color that you want to go with. I like their default options because they've been tested. Uh, now for the button text, I'm going to go with something like, you know, send me my free training. So I'm going to go here. This is what people would click on. Uh, so we're going to say, uh, send me my free training. And then the next thing it says here is page content. And so this is where you could actually put in a video if you had a video opt-in form. Um, so let's say that I wanted to throw this video on here. I could go out here to YouTube, find a video that I want to use, and just go to share. And then I'm going to select embed. And I could actually right-click and copy this and embed it directly into uh, my content here. So I'm just going to throw that in there. And let's go up here. You could choose, you know, no logo or image, which is what we're going to go with right now. And, you know, let's say your headline goes here. So I'm just going to swipe my headline. Generate $100 per day using PLR content. Um, one thing that I personally like to do is I like to uh, just copy and paste in my content there into a notepad so that it copies over cleanly. So we're going to do that real quick. So your headline goes here. Just going to copy that. Next thing we want to do is scroll on down. Subheadline, we're going to keep it at that for now. Uh, footer text. This is you know what you would include in the footer. You could just say we respect your privacy. Um, so you could put that down there. 
and we're just going to preview what we have right now. So you can see here in just a matter of minutes, I actually created a very clean uh, mobile type friendly landing page that is going to get people's attention. Yes, it looks very, very simple, uh, but that is the thing with landing pages uh, today. They're very simple, but they're very clean looking, which is what we have going on here. And notice, again, you don't have to have a video at the top, but video does very well for opt-ins. And so I could choose to have a video or not have this video, and I'll show you what happens as soon as I tweak something in here. So I'm going to take away the video now and we're just going to remove that and let's go over here and say um, you know like the main text font I could go on in here and say um, let's see follow this proven and simple formula for generating real income through the internet and again I'm just copying and pasting it into notepad and you could write in your stuff directly in there in the editor if you didn't have it already written out. And let's go on down here. And you could actually do things like, you know, put in bullet points. You could say, you know, video number one, video number two. Again, you would want to put like features, what they're going to discover. So you could say, you will discover, you know, how to turn a PLR articles into PowerPoints that send you large amounts of traffic or something like that. So you could throw in those as, as bullet point options if you choose to do that. Then I'm going to click on preview. Um, you know, notice how it shows up there. I could decide that I want to remove some elements of it. So I'm just going to click on that. And let's go over here. Let's say we want to remove that part of things. And we'll go back over here. And you could always change the color of your font down here in the main section. So we could say, let's make it like a, like a bluish color. Make it bold. And then we'll scroll back here, go to preview. And there you go. So now we've got, you know, pretty simple, clean looking page. It's actually similar to a lot of pages you've probably seen. And then once it says send me my free training, then it's going to take me to a box where people could submit their info. So I want to show you the autoresponder integration, which is super, super simple. So you come up here, choose your autoresponder. Typically it's going to be Aweber or Git Response. And this is where you just plug in your autoresponder info. So I'm actually going to just plug in my autoresponder list ID. Plug that right in there. Then I'm going to go to my redirection URL and plug that in there. And then you could, you know, choose your starting message, which you could just go at zero, so it'll start automatically. Or one would be like your first follow-up, so you'll just go with that. Script integration, step four, you could actually skip that part of things. Again, we'll go back here to preview and click send me my free training. Just enter your details below. Perfect. Let's say I want to add my name here. I could actually come up here and just say yes, I want to include my name. Go back to the preview box and there it is. Now you might be wondering why there's two steps there for them to put that in. It's actually been tested a lot with landing with lead pages with many other programs where the two-step integration seems to you know encourage people to opt in. Now you can tweak with some of those settings if you choose um, but you don't you know you don't have to. So you could actually go here um, if you had other monkey software, you could use this, but you could, again, could ignore that part. So it's just a really powerful tool. There's lots of, uh, you know, just lots of options for you to go with there. You could actually make the button text an actual hyperlink if you chose to. Um, so let's say like we were promoting an affiliate product. I could actually put in my affiliate URL there. And so when people clicked on this button that said, you know, click here for more, it would take them right on over uh, to my affiliate page. So I could create very simple, super quick affiliate landing pages that I could use to get people to land on and then fire them over to a, you know, to a website where they could actually check out, 
you know, a certain offer that I have going on that I'm promoting as an affiliate. So in a matter of seconds, you can actually create some pretty clean looking pages. And let me show you the thing that I love most. Again, it's the mobile optimized version. So if you were to actually click here and I'm going to drag this around so it fits within the screen here. So you'll notice as I'm actually taking this right now and dragging it around, you'll notice that it resizes to fit my screen. So you'll notice it's resizing as I go. And so this would be like the size I have if I had a mobile device, for example. And if as I expand, like let's say they have like an iPad, you'll notice it adjusts to fit the screen. And so that's how you can test if, if a page or if your landing pages are mobile responsive. My pages currently, like this one, are not mobile responsive at it by any means. And so the fact that this tool does that was a big win for me. And again, you can play around the background font. You saw how quick and easy I created one of these. And then, you know, name, email, boom, people are added to your email list. So it's a really cool tool. Lots of flexibility with it. You can tweak with the color. Oh, and before I get too far ahead of myself, let me show you probably one of the coolest features of this, which is the background video. So what you can actually do here is go up here grab a link to a YouTube video. So I'm going to go up here and go to share and I'm going to copy this YouTube link to my video here. And that's if I wanted to have a background video. You'll notice that actually like PayPal has been using this a lot on their main homepage and some other sites. And you want to make sure muted is, is selected unless you want the video to play automatically. Uh, but I do want to show you this. And so let's go to preview here and we'll give it just a moment here to load up. Okay, so let's go here. We'll go right back here again. Grab our YouTube link, which is going to be at the top of the browser here. You'll want to use that YouTube link, the one up here, not the sharing link. So you want to use the one in your address bar for your chosen video. Paste it in here, and then we're going to click on Preview. And what you're going to see here is my video is actually playing in the background, and there's movement going on, which just draws people in. And then as we resize it here, you can actually see that it resizes with my screen. So here's this is a video I recorded a while back uh, for I Am Guru PLR. You see how cool that is. There's movement going on, and it's just kind of a really unique way to kind of get people to opt in. And so that right there is a, something that they tested, and they found that they got over a 40% conversion when they added in movement. And so you could do all kinds of stuff like have motion, background loops going here. Uh, you could plug those in. And all I did was just copy and paste it a YouTube link. And if that's too much for you, just go with the blank page. I will say on mobile devices, they aren't set up to play the video in the background, but they will show the solid color. So it's still going to work great on mobile devices that's nothing to worry about but on computers it just really jumps out at people and just it's totally unique and I think it's just a great feature in fact you're going to see this at PayPal you might think this is corny but PayPal many other big companies have been using videos uh, for the background for quite some time now so again final thing to do here we'll click on save and what you're going to see is once you save it and again, another awesome feature. There's a couple options. For one, I could actually copy this link right here and they host it for me. And I go up to my browser and I paste it in there. And my landing page is actually going to show up for me now. Like they actually give me a link that I can actually use right away. So I don't even have to upload anything. So that means you are as you know, quick as you can, as quick as you hit save, you can actually start sharing this link on Facebook. You can start using it. You could also take this link and go or go here to download and you would actually download a, you know, download the HTML file directly here. And then you could actually use, you know, Composer or just load it right up. You're not going to have to use another software, but you could load it on up to your own server. So you're ready to go. You could also uh, copy and paste this tracking pixel here, which would actually go on to your landing page, your confirmation page. And that way you could actually track conversions to see how your page is converge, uh, how your page is converting for you. And then again, straight from here, you can actually share your page on Twitter, Facebook, Google+, LinkedIn, and via email. So it's a really cool software. You can go over here to your pages and actually see your pages and you'll see like impressions, you'll see submits, you'll see the actions that people were taking. It's got just so many, so much flexibility to it.